This GoPro has been at the bottom of the ocean for five years. Yo, what up everybody? So this video is about me finding the long lost GoPro. Yep, I'm back in rainy old England and somebody contacted me on Facebook and said they found a GoPro on the beach. They looked at the photos, saw my ugly mug, put it on Facebook and luckily enough somebody recognized me. So I'm on my way to collect it now. I'm probably not gonna take my camera in while I go and collect it because I feel like that might be a bit weird but I'm gonna tell you all about how they found it straight after collecting it in just a minute. I've got it, I got the GoPro. It looks very corroded but apparently it actually still turns on which is insane. So I'm gonna get it home and look at it and see exactly how old the photos were because I actually remember this being one of the most epic GoPro sessions of my life and being devastated when I lost it because I remember a rainbow. I'm pretty sure it was an epic session with Eric Reinstrup when I lost it. So uh, Eric, you're about to get some new photos. But let's go home and look at the photos properly. So I've got home and I put the GoPro on charge and this is the moment of truth that I want to share with you guys. Does the GoPro turn on? Hmm. Hey, hey, what? Oh my God, it's on. This GoPro has been at the bottom of the ocean for five years. Five years. And it's recording me right now. Wow. That is incredible. What I'm gonna do is show you some of the cool photos I got because there was even like a really cool rainbow and a rain school in this session. So check out these. And also I'm going to throw together an action edit of all the best clips because me and Eric were filming each other with the selfie stick and we got some really cool shots. So here is my action edit from the GoPro that was lost in the bottom of the ocean for five years. Wow. Now, at the time, the GoPro 4 Black had just come out, and this was one of my first sessions on it. I'd bought a cheap selfie stick, and the GoPro was winding itself off the actual whole head of the stick itself. So at this point, the camera completely fell off the end of the stick into the water, and it was only about chest deep, but the tide was really strong. And you could see on the video footage, the GoPro is like rolling around and, and we were trying to reach around and grab it, but we couldn't find it. And the GoPro was gone. We were devastated because we just had this epic sunset rainbow session. And to get the clips back is unbelievable. I never ever expected to get the clips back. The people that found it actually found the GoPro about a mile away from where I lost it. I lost it about a mile out at sea and it's gone round the sandbar and into the harbour entrance and they were walking their dog along the waterline when they found it. The reason why I know that it was five years ago is because there's a timestamp 
on the file itself so I can see on my laptop that it was actually filmed five years ago so pretty insane I honestly thought at the time imagine you know that time capsules lost forever I wonder if someone finds it you know in the future and the fact that they actually have is is insane right and I'm going to announce the winner of the last video's giveaway now I've got 310 comments on the video what I'm going to do is use a number generator to generate a random number and then I'm just going to count down from the top and pick so are you ready 93 is the lucky number so I'm actually going to count down 93 comments until I find whoever it is I wish I didn't pick such a big number it's going to take me ages here goes 28 29 30 31 90 91 92 93 Marcus Timgren you won my swag pack congratulations Marcus I'm on your con your channel but it doesn't seem to have any contact details so Marcus Timgren please email me at sam underscore light at me dot com send me your address and I will get that out to you soon as possible Hey, and thanks a lot for watching, guys. I really, really appreciate all the comments, the likes, the subscribes. I'm finding it really motivating, this whole YouTube stuff. So keep sending me the love, and I'll keep making videos. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.